Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today the Teletubbies and I are camping. There's our little cabin and we are in the forest looking for some wood for our campfire. Ooh, there's a fungus on a tree. And look at the roots on this tree. It came right out of the ground. I'm not sure why, but some trees can get sick, just like humans. Here's another fungus on this tree. Back at the campsite, the Teletubbies want to play a game. That's our favorite thing to do when we're camping. How about we play ladder golf? Have you ever heard of that, Tiny Fans? The fire has started, and after ladder golf, we're going to roast some hot dogs. Here's our game. They come with yellow balls and green balls. There's little beads inside, and there's two attached to each string. The first one to 21 points wins. And we use this tool to keep track of our points. Each bar is worth a certain number of points. The top one's worth three, the middle yellow bar is worth two points, and the bottom gray bar is worth one point. And this is how you get points. We throw our ball and string over to the other ladder. All right, I hit the yellow bar, so I would get two points. Oh, I missed on my second throw. Let's try one more time. Yes, I got three points for the top bar. Three plus two equals five points. Hey, look, Poe found some red ladder golf balls. You can play, Poe. I'm just going to finish my game with Tiny Treasures. Tiny Treasures is yellow. Oh, the first one was a miss. Now it's time to throw the second one. Oh, another miss. Last chance, Tiny Treasures. One point for Tiny Treasures. We're all getting hungry. It's time for some yummy hot dogs. Tiny Treasures was nice enough to organize each hot dog bun on its own napkin. And now it's time to put our hot dog wiener on the stick. You have to be very careful, Tiny Treasures, Minnie. It's sharp. Oh, I think I'll help you just a little bit. There, that's better. We don't want your wiener to fall off in the fire. And remember, tiny fans, fire is hot. So we stay a safe distance away while we're roasting. And when we're done roasting, the metal stick will be really hot. So we want it to cool and get an adult to help us take the wiener off. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today, Daniel Tiger and his family are going to play a fun game. Our family just purchased this beautiful wooden spinning wheel, numbered from 1 to 23. And last night, Tiny Treasures numbered pieces of paper to play a family game together. This wooden wheel is from a popular store called Ikea. We love wooden toys and we also love games. This one allowed us to be creative. Here are the little cards numbered 1 to 23. Although if you land on the black, you miss a turn. But if you land on a prize, you get to pick a little treat from Tiny Treasure and Tiny Treasure's mini Halloween candy. And yes, we still have lots of Halloween candy because the rule in our house is too much sweets at once isn't good for you. So it's just a special treat once in a while. Daniel Tiger asks if his sister would like to go first. That's very nice of you, Daniel. She says, thank you. Baby Margaret spins the wheel. And she lands on the white number 12. 
Let's find the number 12 card. There it is. Oh, and baby Margaret wins a prize right away. What would you like to pick, baby Margaret? A box of Smarties. Good choice. Now it's time for Daniel Tiger's turn. Uh-oh, Daniel landed on a black number 22. Sorry, Daniel, you miss your turn. It's Mum Tiger's turn. White number nine. Let's see what the card says. Go up and down the stairs two times in 30 seconds. I'll time you, Mum Tiger. Ready, set, go! You did that in 12 seconds. Good job, Mum Tiger. Now it's Dad Tiger's turn to spin. You landed on number six. Let's see what it says. Spell the word animal in 10 seconds. Okay, I'll start the timer. A N I M A L. Great, that was six seconds. You did it. And baby Margaret was the only one to win a prize. So she's decided to share her Smarties with everyone. And that is a wonderful act of kindness, baby Margaret. It feels good to do kind things and share with others. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today, Peppa's family is going on a road trip. Peppa and George pack all sorts of activities to keep them busy in the car. They have audio books, road bingo, and hangman. Peppa and George hop in the back seat and put on their seat belts. Mommy Pig and Daddy Pig put all of the luggage in the purple car top carrier. Let's see what they've packed. Ooh, look at Mummy Pig's lovely bag with all the blue flowers. They've packed clothes, a hair dryer, toothpaste, a red comb, and some warm socks. George and Peppa are ready to play hangman. Peppa goes first. George, my word, has four letters in it. Oh, wait, but before you guess, we need to flip over the hangman. Okay, George, what letter would you like to guess first? T! Mm, sorry, George. There is no T in Peppa's word. Peppa flips the T over. And George is ready to guess again. P. Oh, yes, George. There is a P in my word. It's the first letter in the word. Oh, and guess what? We forgot to turn the hangman's head over when George guessed the T. George's next guess? O. Sorry, George, there is no O. We flip it over, and this time we flip over the shirt of the hangman. George guesses another vowel, E. Sorry, George, no E in Peppa's word. 
there must be a vowel in that word. I. Yes, George, there is an I. It's the second letter in my word. George tries to figure the word out. Maybe it's the word pigs. George guesses the letter G. Sorry, George, it's not the word pigs. There is no G. George has another look at the word. P, p, pink. Pink is George's guess. That's Peppa's favorite color. Yes, George, you got it. Pink, P I N K. George has won the first game of Hangman. What games could you play while you're in your car? And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Tiny Treasures and Toys. Please subscribe. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we have a brand new Disney Frozen toy called Olaf's Ice Castle Escape. And there's poor little Olaf. He fell out of the castle, so he's just shaking around in the box. So let's open up and play a fun Olaf rescue game. Okay, everything's out of the box. Here's our little ice pegs that we're going to poke into the castle. We have the little spinner and it tells us how many pegs we're going to put in the castle each time. And then of course we have Olaf who we need to rescue because look who's in the castle. It's the snow monster. Ah! So it says to spin a few times and then we place Olaf down on the peg firmly. All right, is that good? I think so. And then we have to pop the pegs into these holes and Olaf will eventually pop out and we've rescued him. Now we have a similar game to this but it's in a pirate version and we've done that in a couple of our videos right let's get started let's spin oh so i need to put two of the pegs in all right let's start with the front one i think i put it in this way oh no olaf popping out i'll put another peg in here nope no Olaf popping out yet. Spin. Oh, just one. It doesn't spin very well. Oh, it's very tight. Ah, I can loosen the screw. Let's get my little screwdriver and loosen that screw just a bit. And that should help the spinner. Oh, much better. All right, we fixed that. Okay two more okay i'll go down here this time oh i think i have to go this way oh and olaf popped out let's watch that in slow motion tiny fans that didn't take long how many pegs did we do one two three This could be a fun game to play with your family or friends, but remember, when you have small little pieces like this, it's important to clean up, clean up, so that the pieces don't go missing, because if the pieces go missing, you can't play the game anymore. So thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye! Tiny treasures and toys. Please subscribe. I feel cold. Wow. Would you please help me put on my jacket? 
Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. We are here with Caillou today, and this is our talking Caillou doll. Uh, I'm thirsty. Oh, may I have some milk, please? Yes, you may. What nice manners, Caillou. We're going to play a game with Caillou called the Caillou Storytime Game. Let's open up the box and see what's inside. I see some instructions and a soft little blanket. And it looks like there is some puppy or kitty fur on this blanket. And then some discs with pictures on them to tell stories. So let's tell a story today, tiny fans. Once upon a time, there was a boy named Caillou. He woke up one morning and went straight to mom where they had some one-on-one -on -one time and she read him one of his favorite stories. Caillou had some breakfast and then went to go make his bed. He brushed his teeth and got dressed for the day. Caillou loves to draw. He drew a picture of his family beside their house. Okay, Caillou, Mom said. It's a nice day. It's very sunny. And it's time to go to the beach. Caillou got his bucket, his shovel, and his duck floaty toy. He loves playing in the sand and built a sand castle. Time to go home. Caillou walks through the door and he sees balloons everywhere. Surprise! It's Caillou's birthday and his friends were there to greet him with cake and gifts. Happy birthday, Caillou! And speaking of cake, here is a little tiny cupcake that Tiny Treasures made. It's their friend's birthday, and I get a cupcake too. Mm -mm. And thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. We sure hope you enjoyed our video today. We're here to ask our fans for some help. Did you know only 15% of our fans have subscribed to Tiny Treasures? So you can help us by pushing the subscribe button and subscribe to our channel. It helps us get recognized by YouTube when we gain subscribers. That way we can continue to make fun learning videos every single day. And for those fans who have already subscribed to our channel, a great big thank you.